Keon, um, so far my win rate this season, or preseason with Keon is 100% in 8 games. So let's see if we can keep our 100% win rate. Literally the opposite of my kill. My kill is a 0% win rate, my Keon is 100% win rate. So, let's not break it this game, hopefully. Okay, so like I said in the lane, we're going to let him push towards us, and we're just going to see us. Um, and get our Moby Boots, and wait for our jungler. We can only fight him if our jungler comes. We can't really fight him without him. Oh, 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 oh. Our level one's pretty bad. That did not work out, but I mean, at least we didn't die. Nidalee did have to use her flash though. Let's look at this Chroma for a second here. I like how each Chroma changes the three little prongs on her blade, like the little pictures on them. This gun looks pretty cool, Chroma. Yeah, it looks really nice. What do I think about Corrupting Plot Start? Um, I don't like it personally, because I feel like you lose all sort of any pressure early game when you go Corrupting Plot. I think it's good, but I think what I do is better. Because you still get really good sustain with the three health potions, except this can actually build into your items. And it allows you to take Legend Tenacity into Triumph, which I think our Legend Tenacity is the best rune in the game. Actually, into their team, Legend Tenacity is awful. What see? They literally have the only CC that they have on their team is Pike Sun. Oof, that's done for them. I can't. I cannot do anything there. Nidalee's gonna die too. I don't know why she's trying to walk in there. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, this is gonna be a hard one, guys. This is gonna be a long game or a short one. I could get level 2 ganked by Graves, because Graves is probably just going to run straight to his red buff. If you guys watched my Zoe video, this is a similar situation. Okay, so I'm going to get pushed because I'm scared of getting ganked. Mesopotamia, hello! Longsword. Yeah, that's actually fine too. It's similar to what I do, but I like more sustain. And it kind of sucks for me too, because, because he wasn't in lane, the wave's pushing towards him, which is not what I want. Nidalee, this is so dumb. Why? I don't know why I'm entertaining this idea of invading. It, it, they know. They know. They're coming. Uh, you can't do this, Nidalee. Just go to your blue buff. You're gonna be level 1 for 5 minutes. Yeah, that actually looks really cool. The blue, uh... Enchantment matches really well. Okay, Wave's bouncing back into me, I think, now. Which is what I want. Yeah, Nid Nidalee got, is pretty doomed. She had to waste her flash level 1, and then she she really stupidly like ran into that bush, killed herself when 3 people were in it, and she knew 3 people were in it. She should have started blue buff, I think. Like, when you use your flash level 1 on jungler, and they have any sort of chance to invade you, you just go the, the safe buff. Okay. One for one top lane is actually okay. I'm trying to thin this a little bit. Leona died too. This is going to be a hard game, guys. Maybe my 100% rate is going to lose now, but I feel like I didn't even get to play this game. All level 1 cheese. I think after next wave we should be able to get our mobies. Maybe even this one. Maybe at the end of this wave. If we last it this whole wave, we should maybe we'll be able to get mobies. kill rumble here i'm gonna get water to prepare for nidalee coming here okay nice that's worth tell me push please nidalee i think we might need to push one more yeah we need to push one more or else it's good the wave's pretty bad for me okay so i'm gonna go like this 
this. And after he gets oh god, okay, well I'm gonna run here. I'm just gonna run down the river with my movement speed. I'm fine. Nidalee's kind of inting though. Well, Nidalee ints again. Unlucky. She she tried too much. Thoughts on new Diana? It seems really, really strong. Okay, so let's get our Moby boots. And this, and this. Now we can at least start trying to carry the maps a little bit here. This is a disaster game so far for my team. For me, it's fine. Yeah, but can I carry? Rumble's missing. He doesn't have flash now. Nidalee should honestly just keep ganking mid lane. I have my ultimate. Graves is really fed. I don't know if I can go on the hunt this game try to kill him. I think I have to play off of bot lane. I could probably win bot lane for them. That's really important if I do. So I'm going to run bot lane here. We should get pike here. You? That looks funny. Sorry guys, I was seeing heroes. Bruiser Diana seems super fun. Yeah, with Conqueror, I think it might be pretty broken. Me and uh, Nocturne can make plays around the map. I'm pretty sure that Graves is top side. Let me get some vision. Yeah, I knew Graves was top. You see, I pinged him. I was able to tell because Rumble went top side. Usually, uh, the enemy or your laner will feel more uh, safer if they go towards the side their jungler's on. Okay, now we see Rumble. If they die bot lane, I'm gonna be so sad. And Rumble's gonna go there. This is actually a good TP though. I think he should have went for Pike, and I could have dealt with Lucian. No, oh, the shield. Dang, that shield's so annoying. They got Herald. It's fine. Okay, we're gonna get our lethality. Actually, we're gonna get Tiamat here. And this, and a pink board. He might be heralding mid lane too. But we have Nidalee there, hopefully, to help a little bit. <sighs> okay. Hi Luke's, one of my thoughts on Vladimir this season, really strong. I don't play him, but I think he is really strong. I think he's a better top laner than he is a mid laner, but I still think he's playable mid lane. We can kill him. His flash is the same timer as mine though, so he's gonna have it. I'm gonna get this because I'm gonna look to roam soon. I wanna, oh my god, Nocturne has six deaths. Nocturne's like getting kind of fed and feeding at the same time. So I'm gonna look to roam top. There might be a pink ward in here though. There's not. So I'm gonna pink ward it myself. Can we dive him? We probably can. Okay, it's 
It's kind of scary. Next wave, I might look to go up. If he's he's gonna ward over here now. Yeah, he knows. It's fine. We just go back mid lane and pick up the wave. It's gonna be the season of eighty assassin. Do you think so? We should wait for Nocturne's ult. Okay, they heralded bot lane. I need to go bot soon. Okay, so I think they probably know. Oh, maybe they don't know, actually. Yeah, they don't know. They have an idea, but they don't know for sure. I can't kill Graves. This is really sad. He's so, like, ahead right now. Maybe I could kill Rumble, actually, but he has, he has a ton of armor. He just used all his ability, so... Yeah, he has too much armor. I can't kill him. He's gonna ult me, maybe. because I'm a little scared. <laughs> follow Kiwi people. Kiwi I people. Oh. One for one. Probably not terrible. I need Nidalee to gank. I don't even think I need to flash there. Okay, and we got Graves ult too. Definitely winnable game. I can carry this. Oh, he ran into it. She's not gonna get it though. It's still. Okay, nice. Run, Italy. Run, Kaisa. Kaisa's fine. Can I do something here? I think I can carry this. Especially, yeah, because it's right here he's inting. Oh. I don't have my ult. Nah, this is probably really bad. I don't have ult. She just said nothing. I can't 1v5. Rumble has so much armor. I will try to make a play here after Pike wastes that. Okay. Got one, at least. Trying to scare him away a little bit. If I had a teammate or a team here, I'd try to go in with the bush. Oh, what happened there? I didn't go invisible. Okay, fly into it. Breathe. Thank you so much for the cute dog one. Did I try a Pelios? I tried him on PBE. I did. In, in a custom tool. I'll try it. Because I'm hungry. Yeah, I entered. I thought I'd be able to uh, turn invisible and do something, but I wasn't. Okay, got the shutdown. I don't think he wins this at all. It's a tank rumble. Can I kill this guy? Maybe. Let's try. Kaisa is scaling. Yeah, that is a fact. It made sense when I tried him on PB. When I read the kid, it was like, what? It? Some of these sentences literally don't make sense. Okay, 
got level 11. Graves is there. Can I kill him? He has no armor, maybe. So I have my ult. I missed that word. He might be here. I don't have my ult, so I should go the safe way. Okay, he's not there yet. Let's use the new Infernal Dragon's advantage. He might be doing Herald. He's probably doing Herald. He is doing Herald for sure. Nocturne doesn't have ult. I'm going to try to wrap around though and kill him anyways. He's on it. Uh, this could be me inting. It probably is me inting. I have Nocturne now. Oh, you messed up. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Run, Nocturne. Okay, we take those. That's okay. This resets too. It's really good. Yeah, okay. Not bad. That's actually pretty good. Considering the, si the situation is pretty good. That Kais is Ghost, by the way. Oh, it is? Okay. I have more confidence now. So my 100% win rate will min be maintained. Every case is a certain T. But hey, we are a certain T supporter on this stream. We are Zoe mains. Well, I'm a Zoe main, so... I cannot say I dislike the certain T. I'm so excited to eat, guys. I haven't eaten anything today. So close to being a lead partner? Am I? I don't even know. If when it happens... That would be cool, but I don't even know. I don't keep track of that. I don't even know what you need to do that. Oh, we got him. I should help Leona, but I think she's fine. I'm gonna go into a side lane for a little bit here. <laughs> Thank you so much for the follow. Bet Sabe. Delete all two champions, I would press it on the Zoe main too. Mm. Deleting Yasuo but deleting Zoe, I wouldn't do it. I think his champs are very fun. I think he's I think he is the best champion designer. I love like a lot of champions, but I think certainly she's champions. Like they have the it factor, you know? People love they're very polarizing champions, pretty much all of them. Kaisa can rotate mid and I'll just pick up the bot wave here. But Thresh though, I hate Thresh. He's very he's also polarizing. Or I hate playing against Thresh. I think he's a cool champion, but I hate playing against him. Um walking over here could be me and Sing. We saw people on the bottom river. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that and get out of here. Leona's fighting this battle by herself here. Not for long, though. I'm gonna keep chasing Pike. My Q would- if I didn't TM out, I might have killed. Got him. You do it for a Kali? Oh, I forgot about a Kali. I love a Kali too. Okay, get me out of here now. I'm gonna pick up the bot wave. Gangplank might be here. Okay, I'm gonna recall and get some more lethality. Okay, we almost have our second lethality item, which is a really big power spike. And we have our ult up too. Can I one-shot Gangplank? He has cabbies and two items. Maybe I, if I don't one-shot Gangplank, I die. So maybe I shouldn't try. I'm not on vision right now. So if someone face checks me, I kill. They still haven't seen me. My dust blade lets me know that. I could try to kill Lucian here. If I'm going to. I 
can still kill him all. I messed up. But it's okay. He should kill Pike too. Pike doesn't have abilities. Nice. Okay, that's fine. Summer hit him miss. Hit or miss. I guess they never miss, huh? You got a boyfriend, I bet he doesn't kiss ya. <laughs> An oldie buddy goodie. Also, if you guys want to watch a video on the new Diana rework and you haven't already, you can type exclamation point new vid and it will give you the link to showing off the new Diana rework with some gameplay of it if you guys want to see. Gotta leave now, Yuki. Come on. That's, you, you can't tell me that's not what you're here for. I'm gonna pick up the bot wave. New Diana will ruin your Aphelio schemes. She will jump on you when you're Aphelio since she will one-shot you. I think I'm gonna really like the new Diana though. She has she's like an AP Kiana, kind of. Less team fighty. Actually, your team fighting is fine. Do I kill him here? Maybe. Yes we do. We unleashed the beast. Really, how nice of her. She came and just healed me. Why'd they even switch her ENR? Because she's pretty bad right now. Like, she's not bad. Like, she's not the worst champion in the game, but... Like, uh, you know. Aphelios mid is Diana's food. Literally. I want to try Aphelios mid, but good luck to me playing him on PB. We're just gonna have to wait to to play him on live. She was a minion to level six or so. Yep, that was her weakness. So I don't know what her weakness is now. I guess I guess her Q has a long cooldown. Guys, like you could do this with Kiana. You can go invisible three times. If you do it like that, you have to catch a bush the second that you go invisible for the first time. Then you can invis three times without them being able to see you for like less than like half a second. Diana could still only go in like Leona. That is true too. Yeah, I guess that is true. Next objective is this Infernal, I guess. But uh, Baron is up too, so it's kind of risky. I don't think they do Baron that fast though. And Graves is bot side, so we just play around the dragon here. Especially, um, Kiana is really, really good for dragon fights because of the ult. The ult's so good. Graves is here, maybe. And he's gonna dash over this wall. Yeah, we kill. They're both dead here. Poor Pike flashed into the Kai'Sa. I don't think he saw her because of the Nocturne ult. Kiana's the best R in the game. For an AD Assassin, yes. Yeah, actually, her ult my- What ult is better than Kiana's? I have to kill him for you, Okay, he is out to you. Did you give her a bit more sustain to be a proper AP Bruiser instead of a Diver? Yeah, if they're, the thing is like, they don't know what to do with Diana, I feel. Because I think Diana mains... I, I'm speaking on behalf of Diana mains, which I know barely of. But I think Diana mains prefer the more bursty playstyle than the more bruisery playstyle. So I, but I think Riot kind of wants to make Diana an AP Bruiser, but at the same time, Riot doesn't like support AP Bruisers itemization-wise. So I feel like they're just kind of like confused on Diana a little bit. Ooh, I stole the Baron. For my own team. Her R is hard counter and Karthus R. Yeah, her new R seems pretty good. Let's get this actually. This item's kind of underrated, I feel. It doesn't give you as much lethality, but if you guys don't know, the 
The uh, spotting wards, when you don't see them, it has a cooldown, but if you actually see a ward, even if uh, the item's on cooldown, you still always do triple damage to it. So you can one-shot uh, yellow wards, as long as you have this item, and two-shot pink wards. Yep. I mean, river. And I can afford it. I feel like this game's pretty much over, like, we win. I just have to uh, get the best packs that I can. I don't have words. Okay. We won! 107 rates maintained.